An active investigation underway as police search for the suspect they say shot and killed a woman in her central Fresno home. Investigators are now asking the public for help in finding the victim's killer. Action News reporter Natalie Granda is live at police headquarters tonight with more about why police are calling this a difficult case. Natalie. Well, Warren and Graciela, investigators say that they haven't had any witnesses come forward. Therefore, they don't have any suspect descriptions or any leads at this time. What they do know, however, is that the victim was the un unintended target in this tragic shooting. A 61-year-old Fresno mother and grandmother was found dead in her own home, but police say the identity of her killer remains a mystery. Everything is stating that at least the victim that's deceased at this time was innocent. Um, we feel it's a senseless act of violence. Lieutenant Larry Bolin says the victim is longtime Fresno resident Anita Shelby. Her family found her in the living room inside her home along East Normal Street Sunday morning. Police found she had multiple gunshot wounds to her upper body and say neighbors told investigators they heard several gunshots just hours before she was found. There were multiple shell casings found in front of the location, which indicated multiple shots being fired through the front door of the location. With no video of the crime or any witnesses, Bolin says that also means they don't have any leads. It's a difficult case, there's no doubt about it, and time will tell. Um, we're hoping to get a break in it with that anonymous phone call. Police say while they don't know much about the suspects, they do know the victim was well liked and that she was not the intended target in the crime. She was someone that was very friendly but kept to herself. Uh, many of the neighbors or people that recognized or knew her in the neighborhood stated every time she walked by she'd say hello. Investigators are now looking into the evidence left behind in hopes of figuring out why Shelby's home was targeted. Now, investigators are trying to see if they can match up any of the shell casings at the scene with any of the other shell casings found in other past shootings. They do ask anyone with any information on this case to call them here at the Fresno Police Department. Your call can remain anonymous. For now, live in downtown Fresno, I'm Natalie Granda, ABC 30 Action News. Thank you for watching. For more videos like this from ABC 30, just make sure to hit that subscribe button below.